February, Chairman McHenry, Senator Scott, and I sent you a request of documents and information on your climate disclosure rule. Uh, the fact is, uh, other than a couple of emails that were private, you have produced only publicly available documents in response to that request. And I'm going to highlight a couple of those. You sent us a copy of the public comment file on the rule. You sent us a copy of the rule itself, twice. Uh, you sent a copy of your testimony the last time you appeared before this committee. You sent us a copy of your public calendar. You sent us copies of public speeches, testimony, and press releases from you and your fellow commissioners. You sent us a copy of a public FSOC report from 2021. And the most interesting and frankly dumbest example of this that we received to date is a copy of a letter that myself and Chairman McHenry sent you congratulating you as being confirmed as chair in 2021. I have that one in my file already. Uh, so frankly, it's insufficient and frankly unacceptable what has been going on. I think it's an embarrassment to you and to your team that you sent me a copy of the letter I sent you as, and then tried to call that responsive. Uh, that doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. And uh, further, your response letter to the chairman and myself, the SEC staff admitted that the proposed rule, quote, could increase costs, quote, close quote, related to energy prices under certain circumstances, but you provided no analysis, the actual information that we were looking for, not my letter to you congratulating you as becoming chair. We wanted the analysis on how the commission determined that.